Jeez, all those ships and they didn't drop diddly squat. I know it's they dropped less out here, but still. But I thought that said Bulbasaur. All right. I was like, that that's not a Star Wars ship. That's a Pokemon. This is horrible. I skipped farming that. All right, hold on. Invasion. Okay, where are they going? Invading Mazalot and the Zygon. Invasion forces be fairly strong of one fleet. Invasion versus local defenses. Outmatch. Including expected particular ground forces would be evenly matched. So go here, here. What's... Isn't this the... Yeah, this is the one they took last time that I was fixing up. Okay. Unfortunately, I don't have the ships to poke and prod in there and weaken it. You're out of here. I don't think we have any big boy bounties yet. Well, we do. Ew, no. We stop that. Now. Come on, give me a something. I'm almost tempted to take the Gazanti, but that's going to cost me. Ooh, give me the victory. Ugh. cruisers are junk. That's raining Gazantes. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I, I missed this. Hold on. What we got over here? Raider class Corvette. I... Okay, I'll take I'll take that. We can upgrade that. No. I have the people. You can just sit there. Right, so we got a oak and prod ship. This is just, that's a, if I didn't have so many of the cargo ships already, I would take, definitely take one of those. That holds lots of cargo. What's oh, getting away over in here? So. There it is. Okay, where, uh... 
Hiding near a barren world system with a giant primary star. So you could be... That, that, those I could handle. Hold on. How many days? 88 days. Where's that big fight up here? Did y'all finish? No, oh, Nemoidia, Nemoidia. Where's the... Let me sell, finagle, all that fun stuff. That's fun. Uh, oh, I want that so bad. I'll get you. No. No. I'm still thinking about doing something fun with that one, Eka. Can you imagine a Star Destroyer with, or something, you know, the largest thing with nothing but beam weapons on it? So, I know I got enough supply. Give me that. Oh, 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 I know. I'm forgetting this. Refit. And we'll 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 keep you for now. Up that. again i haven't been fighting him that's weird that they don't have any experience on him. interest all right pick up a few people Okay, so I got more than enough room. Right. Scan away. Strike craft. Oh, you're all about the fighters. That's right. Uh, Just in case. Let me, let me go in here.
We're going to get this gate real quick. Can grind experience by converted hangers. Interesting. There's the gate. That way, if we get way out there and there's a gate in that system again, then we can get home really, really quick. Do I have any other gates? Nope. Okay. Boy, the car goes in a fight. Hmm. I guess if it's an overwhelming one, and keep them in the back. I saw that. This ascendancy is going to raid Hoth? Why? Okay. I mean, I'm not going to lie. That system has some good ore down there, but... I can think of a lot better targets. Well, what is this? Fleet? What is this? But if a part of your fleet into a detachment, you will remain in control of the main force while a detachment will follow the behavior you... Huh. I take it that's part of the revolution. Killian, that's the... Uh, that's the Ludic Church one. Okay, it's not that far. Is this the Alpha Star, Alpha Spare? No, no. Uh, is that up there? Okay, so worst case scenario, we might travel to there next since I know there is a... I know there's a gate in there. So, Persian League's going to raid the Imperial system. That's not a great system. That might be some dreadnoughts, but if I play my cards right. Ugh. Ugh. I really want to get rid of that Mon Calamari now. It's so slow. Well, hello. High level beacon means future system uh, possibilities. Still wish I could have gotten that star destroyer, uh, just star destroyer. Is that you? 
Alright, so let's save. Alright, now what were we about? You're in here, you're near a barren world. Wow. Rocky, barren, gas, volcanic, jungle, cryovolcanic, gas giant, barren, rocky, metallic. That's not bad. Man, you're spread all over the place. Really? The volcanic's way out there? Jungle, gas, cryo, barren. Let's go there first. There you are. Got you right on the first try. Yep. I want all the ships. No, no, no. You know what? We're just, we're going to send everything in. Let's do this. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too, but I still, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and explore all this. It's not bad, but I still want to take a look at the, that Mansi system. Because that had a lot of possibility plus a gate. So if nothing else, I could take both of these since they're reasonably, reasonably close. Oh, they've got an immobilizer. But I'm going to bet at least the jungle might have some ruins in it. nimble for a uh, mobile all right i don't shit you want to sit there and take it come on concentrating firepower bother me in the slightest come on everybody already at the immobilize ah, 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 ah. Ooh. Uh, let's see. Besides the normal, you know, like the Magic Lib, the Luna, you know, all those that you need to run most mods. That's what? Second Command, which overhauls your skills and how they work by getting executive officers. And I didn't vent them. Are y'all just being that mean? Uh, of course, you know, the Star Wars and its sound effects, yada, yada, yada. Uh, you got the terraforming mod where I can terraform planets. Let's try this again. Uh, I've just added in the industrial revolution or is industrial evolution. I forget. That's the one that's caused me to restart after the last weekend's Chiss Ascendancy start that overhauled a lot of stuff and actually required the reset. I couldn't just add it in. So that way you can... It's got a lot of stuff. Ooh, jeebus. But, ooh, one of the big... Yeah, please. One of the big things is you can take your ships or a ship, drop it off at certain core worlds. And, oh, come on. I turned that off in time and they will repair your ships and get the, the D mods off of them.
along with a lot of extra you know stuff too this is a pain where hold on where is everybody else all right so the acclimators are chasing those two things Did the, oh my, no, no, you're back there. You get up here and fight him and quit lollygagging, chasing the small stuff. You couldn't catch a star. You can barely catch a star destroyer. You're not going to catch a destroyer or a frigate. yeah I, i'm i slowly you know I'll, I'll do a run like hey this was kind of fun you know what would be neat if i could do this and then it's like all right could like the the terraformings i held off on for two two facts two star wars factions because i wanted to make sure before you know before i added it in you know terraforming that, that would be great it would be helpful could star wars do that and then i had to look up like yeah yeah they could kashik was terraformed uh kuwait or kuat was terraformed just so like okay that that was a that was a thing so add it in and then there's other stuff to just make it more interesting like the second commands i can show you that one have you seen sergeant the how a normal ooh, that kind of tickles like the normal skill set for like you as you level Eek. drive him away I ha you have all right so as soon as i get through with the oh i didn't realize he was laying it on that thick let me back off i'll show you with the second commands you have a a skill tree that's a bit different that you get every time you level him just like you're used to but with only certain skills now what you do is you go get executive officers and you can have three. And you can have more, but you can only have three equipped at a time. And what's going to happen is their your other skills. So as you level, they level. Oh, don't come on, come on. Concentrating firepower. Come on, keep keep laying into him. Keep laying into him. Don't let him vent or anything else. Ah, uh, all right. Following your lead. Oh, no, we'll go with you. Bad thing is the ship blew apart, but. We still have hope. We still have a lot of other ships I'd like to. Holding for maximum firepower. All right, you. Oh my, quit destroying them. Just disable. Come on. Targeting at maximum firepower. Attacking target. Now your fighters are gone.
All right, what? Ernie, you take over. I think there's just the one down here. Yeah. Full assault. All right. I still like this ship, but oh, I still hate how slow it is. <laughs> Oh, and that, that's another one. I forgot. That's a really fun mod I have built in is ship experience mod. The more you use a ship, whether it's, you know, you're bringing it out or it's a support ship, the more the ships go along, you use them, you keep them. They, you get, I guess you could say your crews get better with them you can think of it in that sense and they become more effective so they earn experience and you can use that experience to s mod some of the you know the stuff you have in there so instead of spending you know i want a story point to put this mod as an s mod well if you used a ship enough because based on what mod it is there's and the size of your ship, it'll cost different stuff. So you can do that. So, you know, you really like this Star Destroyer. You've been using it forever and it's your baby. Well, all right, do it. Because as you see here, like we did it, like here's the Fulminix. It earned this because of the offensive, defensive, and the support stuff it did. The ships that didn't come in, well, they only got a little bit of experience because they didn't do much, but, you know, they're the support ships. That's what they do. It's like on the support ships, I'll get, like, efficiency, usually efficiency overhaul, cargo expansions for them, and then kind of depends. I have been, you know, known to put the, I forget the name, it, it's a... I think it's called battle droid mod where pretty much you it no longer requires crew the crew is the the battle droids from the clone wars the roger roger you replace the crew with them so you don't need the people uh if let's see actually let's see let me get that i'm just gonna let all of y'all go again all right uh, yes. Oh, God, I got to pay for these. Uh, frigate. I don't want the Corvette. Uh. You know what? No, we're going to load and try again. I'm going to take my three strikes. Okay, yeah, I'm going to take my three strikes. Dismiss all that. But here you go, Sergeant, before I do that. This is you, and this is your skills. Always the same. Well, minus what you're going to pick, but this is always the same. And you you know most of these already. However, here's your other ones, and they'll gain experience with you. And you can, you know, I can take this guy off, put another one in as they they level up. And you can switch it to your play style. That's like, this guy always starts with flux and capacity. And then, you know, as he levels, you'll pick one of these. Well, if you want the higher ones, just like you, you know, you'll get one of these skills as long as you have two of these, you pick. Then, as long as you have three lower, you get one of your elite ones. So, it's a lot more... Instead of the, you know, I'm always going to take this, 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 and this. Then re-roll because I no longer need to produce industrial stuff because I have the, you know, there was like one or two, or technically depending on if you did wolf pack stuff, you know, there was like almost cookie cutter builds. Now it's really on the, the fly what you can do. Which is why, out of my last playthrough, because I didn't see a tech 